Hi, Anthony here, and in this tutorial I'll show you an example of the flying animation in PowerPoint 2016. I'm assuming you already have some basic knowledge on how to use PowerPoint animations. Essentially, I start off with a black and white logo and then fly in the colored pieces. These are the original logos in black and white and color. In order to achieve the animation, I had to reconstruct the logo from individual pieces so I could animate them in order to bring them together. To create the individual pieces, I use a tool called Edit Points in PowerPoint, like the, what you're seeing right now. Essentially, I took a rectangle shape and I turned it into a heptagon. I will be creating a separate tutorial to show you how to use Edit Points in PowerPoint. So now let me show you how to use the flying animation. So once you've created the individual pieces, you place them in their respective positions in the logo. And then we have to apply the flying animation to each of the 13 individual pieces. As you can see in the right side animation panel, it shows you all the animations that I've applied. In order to apply the flying animation, you have to click on the individual piece, go to the animations tab, and then click the fly in animation. Next you have to choose the direction by dropping this box down. As you can see I've applied the fly in from bottom. When you take a closer look at the animation pane, you will notice that the animations are applied in incremental durations. Look at the size of the green bars. When we preview the animation, you can see that all the pieces are flying together but some of them are delayed by the time they reach their respective locations. When we take a closer look at the durations, you will notice that the first three have a duration of 0.75, the next two have a duration of 1.0, and so on and so forth. But the last one, which is the stem of the maple leaf, I've applied a wipe animation. Also the first animation is set to start on click and the rest of the animations are set to start with previous. That's how all the pieces come together. Let's take a final preview of the animation. I well, hope you found this tutorial useful. You will find many more PowerPoint tutorials on my YouTube channel. And if you've got any questions, please leave them in the comment section. Thanks for watching.